Hello. It's uh, Thursday in the morning and my co-host is unavailable. So I thought I'd punch out another video just for grins and giggles and kind of had some things I want to talk about. Nothing like super huge or anything exciting. This will be quick. Just want to pop in again and say hi. Um, one thing I noticed is uh, I got a lot of views on my last video, which kind of actually surprised me. <laughs> um, I got to talking with a few friends of mine that say that the more they view it, the more views I get. So either way, I'm looking popular. Yay! It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, it's been fun though. I've, I really have enjoyed this and I appreciate everyone's support and I really want to extend that appreciation. I, I'm doing this just simply, like I said last night, I, I really, I'm basically doing it for me and um, not looking for popularity. It's not a popularity contest or anything of that nature. It's just, I just want to just let myself out there. This gives me something to look at later. Gives my, gives something more for my kids to look at. And um, I should probably lay off the blonde hair for a while, maybe. No, it's fun being blonde. Uh, I just got to thinking though, with the Facebook thing, you know, I, I, uh, I'm subscribed to like certain news channels on Facebook and, and any more these days, like to be honest, here we go. Using that word again, or that sl slogan, to be honest with you using the, <laughs> Hmm. Calm down, Becky. <laughs> there's a, there's a, I'm, I'm subscribed to certain news channels and they post a lot of bogus stuff on there, to be honest with you. And I don't know why I do that. <laughs> I've, I've been told I say that a lot, but it's just a habit. But they put a lot of false information on there. And I will get a wild hair up my ass and post my opinion on there. And I start a little bit of a fire and people get upset and they get mad and write things and tell me I'm stupid and tell me to go wash my hair with a hair dryer, you know, in the shower and and I'm just thinking to myself, like, is that supposed to, like, make me sad and cry on my big pillow at night or something? I don't know. I just don't understand it. I mean, seriously, I don't get what people, you know, like, if you, if you want to attack a person in terms of, like, when it comes to, for lack of a better word, political posts – have have some facts you know i mean you know and then and then i'll shut up <laughs> but it just doesn't make sense but you know whatever everyone's entitled to their own opinion and their own thoughts and views and stuff like that so but um i also got to thinking about this as well um i know I've, I've kind of been interacting with someone lately and I, I kind of um, have gained a little bit of insight with the person I've been act interacting with. And I kind of had like a little bit of an inspirational moment, an in inspirational, in yeah. here I am, <laughs> I'm going to contradict what I'm going to say. <laughs> Uh, I had an inspirational feeling that 
I kind of may would like to attempt being a motivational speaker considering what I've been through, what I've gone through. And, and I think I could possibly help people or at least inspire people. Um, not really sure how far that would take me, but I would like to at least try. So I'm going to start out with this and I'm going to make it quick and then I'm going to jump off. I'm going to start with this. I'm, I really truly believe that there's a lot of people out there that are struggling with like their personal demons and issues and, and stuff like that and are afraid to ask for help. And that's completely understandable. I mean, when a person asks for help, they're basically showing like the weakest part of their side, the, the most open part of their body where it's, it's almost like their shield is put down. And I want everyone to know that when I'm on YouTube, when I'm doing this right now, when I'm talking, my shield is down and I'm exposing myself. I am showing the world, all 20 of you, <laughs> 21, <laughs> actually, um, I'm showing all of you that it's okay. It's okay to expose yourself and state how you feel and it's okay to cry and it's okay to scream and yell and get it out of you and because get you end up sleeping better at night and then you end up you know feeling better the next day and so for all any of you that are struggling with anything that's going on in your life just you know that there, you're not the only one, basically, you know, I mean, there are so many people out there that have it way worse than you, way worse. <laughs> and there's also people that are willing to shut up and listen instead of giving you advice. And I'm going to maybe probably start a segment of motivational speaking and kind of give you guys a little insight of what I interpret as therapy and, and it, it will be a general, general subject. It won't be directed towards a certain subject of any nature. It'll just be, you know, if you're having a hard time financially, if you're having a hard time with, you know, relationships or whatever, but everyone has a problem. I mean, if you look around the entire room that you're sitting in and think that that one, there's one person in that room that has it together. They don't, they're very good at masking it. Nobody on this planet has it together and it's okay. Cause that's what life is about, you know, self-discovery and compassion and taking care of each other. And so I just want to leave you at that. Um, this is basically an introduction to a new chapter. Um, I want to see how far this goes. If it doesn't, it doesn't, but it will be beneficial for me. And hopefully on my way, you know, in my path of self-discovery and journey and blah, blah, blah. I hope I help people as well. I hope I pick people up and that's what I would like to do. And it would make me feel really good. And I hope you all understand my message. Anyway, hope you guys are having a wonderful morning because it is morning for me. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.